All right, good morning. This is Jeff Scott of Rankin Technical College. I sent out an email this morning, the one that you see on the screen right now, and it says how some students emailed me last night that they could not get their React applications deployed up and running on Netlify or on GitHub pages. I said you have four options. Number one, put it just out on your GitHub repo and take a 10-point penalty for not being able to deploy it. That will still get you 40 out of 50 points of the assignment if you've done the rest correctly. Second, you can rewatch the video I did last Wednesday, and starting at about the one hour mark, I went through the steps. Or you can use watch Dave Gray's video, and I gave you the link to that because that's what I based mine off of. Or you can even try to watch Mr. Gudmiston's video, which is about 30 minutes long on how to deploy it to Google Cloud, and then try that. Now, here's the big thing. I will still accept today only through midnight either your non-deployed React app where you can get 40 out of 50 points or your React app on Netlify or GitHub pages. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to attempt, I'll do the GitHub pages first, but I grabbed, I grabbed um, a copy you know, just to show you, I grabbed that weather app that we did in class. So NPM start, I just brought it up right now. So I come in here, it's got a real ugly background, but if I come in here and type in Wentzville, hit enter, there you go. It's 33 degrees, feels like 22, etc. I'm going to attempt to deploy this right now out to GitHub pages. All right. So let me do this, and I'm going to um, npx kill minus port 3000, so not, I can be sure nothing is running. All right? All right, so all that's good. Let me clear this, and I'm just going to follow the steps that are on there. Now, you will need to do something similar, and you will need to work with your package.json file. Some people have had problems with their package.json file. I am going to send you a copy of mine. In order for you to be able to use it, you will have to go in and make some changes, such as this will have to be the name of your project. All right. You will have to add the pre deploy and deploy things here, and we'll have to add a home page in here. I'm going to do those right now. Again, I'm going to follow the steps on this handout that I gave you. All right. So I've already got the new project. Don't worry about the name because I'm going to use the name of the project as I've got it. I'm not going to do these uninstalls. Screw it. Pardon my French. It, it, it's going to bloat the, the program because there's stuff you don't need, but it's okay. I'm going to start with step three. NPM I GH pages minus D. And that should add GitHub pages. If you go back and look in here, I do not have anything in here that says GH pages. I should in a couple moments. So I'm going to come here. I got to view my terminal again. And I've got to put that in. This says, I'm going to close this too. This says install GitHub pages as a development dependency. It's going to sit and spin and do its thing, and it'll take anywhere up to 30 seconds to a minute. When it comes back, all right, it's back already. I'm going to bring up my package.json again, and there is what it just added. You will have to add that line if you want to attempt to put yours on GitHub pages. You must do that. All right, so now in here, all right. I'm again. I'm following the steps that are in here. So I'm going to put a home page in here. All right. So under the version line in package.json. So under this line, I'm going to put in this. Now I'm going to change it right away. I want to use the same name as my project name, Weather App React Main. So that will change here to Weather App. React main. 
All right. I think you should use the same name for your project in here. Can you make it different? I don't know because I don't try it. All right. So that's that. Now I've got to come in in my scripts line here and I've got to add my pre-deploy and my deploy scripts. All right. And again, that is here. I've already given you these steps this morning. All right. So let me bring that in, move that over. Now that should be everything. So I added this homepage line right here in package.json. I added these two, pre-deploy and deploy here in React. And in package.json. And I put in that command, npm i g h pages minus d. So that's what I've done. So let me save this. So file, save all, and I'm going to close this. All right, now I'm going to just, again, keep following the steps that are in this handout I gave you. From the terminal, do a git init, a git add dot, and a git commit. So let's do those. Git init, git add dot, git commit minus M. And I'm going to put in here deploying to deploying to GitHub pages. That's going to be my commit message. There it is. All right. Again, I'm following the steps that are in here. So I've done that. Create a new GitHub repo with the right name. All right. So that name again is going to be Weather App React Main. So let me grab this and copy. I don't know if it copied it or not. If it didn't, fine. All right. So let's go out to GitHub.com. Let's make a new repository. I'm the owner. I am the owner, React App Weather App React Main. Says the name is available. I'm going to create the repository. I'm going to come back up here and grab that line so I can establish the communication between Git and GitHub. So let me put that in. I can double check by doing a Git remote minus v and it should have that path it does everything so far is great so let's see what we're supposed to do next we knew we're supposed to do our git push minus u origin master all right so let's do that next again i will copy that Let me clear down here and let's put that in Should take a matter of seconds. Good. Now I should be able to go back to GitHub. Refresh, and it should show my stuff in here. There it is. Deploying to GitHub pages. Okay. Again, everything's great so far. Go back to VS Code, and from the terminal, run this command. NPM run deploy. So copy. npm run deploy now hopefully when it gets all done it should show the word published it is telling me i've got some stuff here that's outdated and again one of the reasons all that stuff is outdated is because we're using npx and not vite all right published that's a good sign all right so reopen We don't even have to do this, all right? What you can do, probably the easiest way, it may take some time to build this, I don't know, is while you're in here, go to settings. Under settings, go down to where it says pages. And now it says your GitHub pages site is currently being built, which means it's not built yet. So if I were to go back into here, if I were to go back into my package.json file right here, 
this is the URL that should run this. However, it's still being built. So I'm going to copy the entire thing. Just copy it to the clipboard, but I'm not going to use it yet. All right. But I'm going to go back to here. Again, I'm going to give this some time because it says your site is currently being built. It is 914. I'll give it three or four minutes and see if it comes back and tell me, tells me that it has been built. All right. You should also make sure this says gh-pages and root right here. So what should happen when this gets built is I should get a message that it's at that URL. What URL? This one, which is the same one that I just copied. All right. It says it's still being built. I'm not sure why it is, but let's, I'm just refreshed. It still says it's currently being built. All right. It seems like it's taking a long time, but I'm not complaining. I'm going to go and refresh my water, and I will literally be back in a matter of minutes. All right, it still says it's currently being built. I don't know why it keeps saying that, but let's see if it's actually out here or not. No, oh, there it is. It's here, out on right here. Right there. So I have successfully deployed this. Let's make sure it works. Let's cancel that for now. And again, I will put in Wentzville. Let's see if it's up from 29 degrees or whatever the heck it was, 33 degrees. Okay, so it works. All right, I'm going to stop here, and then I'm going to create another video where I attempt to take this same exact thing, but I'm going to make a new copy of it, and I'm going to attempt to put this out onto Netlify. I'll be back in about two or three minutes.